fans, it's Molly Helmuth here at Stockton 99 Speedway in Stockton, California. Um, I have had exciting news which I haven't updated you guys about and so I just want to recap on my 2012 season. I did get um, my first podium in the super late model division a couple months ago so that was really exciting and I also accomplished my goal of getting 2012 Rookie of the Year for the state of Washington in the super late model division at Evergreen Speedway. This is my last race with the Ron Sutton Winter Circle Driver Development Program so hopefully everything goes fantastic and um, we do have some plans going on for the 2013 season. So um, if you guys have any questions for me, just feel free to ask me. Uh, you guys can follow me at, on Twitter at Molly underscore Helmuth 92 or you can like me on Facebook. So I'm with Ron Sutton himself right now and I'm just going to have him talk about the talent search that you have to go through in order to be a part of the program itself. So Ron, let's talk about um, the driver shootout that you have to go through. Yeah, we've got our first batch of drivers. Uh, we've had probably four or five hundred apply so far, and we're still getting you know twenty or thirty resumes in each day. And we go through them and find the ones that have been winning a lot of races for you know for their age and the right kind of racing series. And those that stand out, you know, we set up interviews and talk with them. And then if we think that they you know have potential, then we invite them to come test. And it's a pretty small number. You know, we'll probably see 10 or 15 in the first shootout weekend and maybe another 10 to 20 in the second shootout weekend that'll be in November. And uh, it's pretty involved. You know, when they're there on Friday, it is a, um, uh, a body fat fitness test. There's a psyche eval. There's a uh, written problem solving IQ test. There's two workshops that they go through, one to prepare them for the shootout and one to educate them and their families about what all's really involved in getting to a racing career. This program has been phenomenal for me. I've learned so much this season, and I have met so many fantastic people, um, along with Ron himself and the crew members and the drivers also. And it's just a huge family. Like, it's a lot scarier than it is, but it's, it's a lot of fun, especially the shootout, because, I mean, like I said, you meet people from New Mexico and Texas and just all over the United States. So. It's a fantastic program, and I um, recommend it to anyone that wants to be a NASCAR one day. race. Um, all the cars are just so even and everyone's pumped up for this last race of the season. I can't thank Ron Sutton Driver Development Program enough for all their hard work that, it, that they have put into the MHRT. Uh, 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 uh.
first practice. It's about four o'clock and so we're gonna get rolling and we're gonna have, I think, about two or three practices. So we'll see how they go and where I qualify and if I'll be in the trophy dash and all that fun stuff. So, wish me luck. Batman. <laughs> but my motor wasn't running as smoothly as it was yesterday. Uh, we think we got the problem fixed, but we're just keeping our fingers crossed that it follows through the whole day, so. Him a couple of times, I said, That's just a sound of the mirror. Yeah. Very funny. Yeah. It was very I'm okay with you. You deserve it. That's what I'm saying. I'll see you in the room. Like you said, it was pretty good. It's my dude. It's like small. It's my first main event and I placed third. Um, I got beat by 22 thousandths at the end of um, the race on the last lap at the start finish line. So I will be starting third row outside beside Tyler Edwards, which is one of my teammates. So um, the car is fast and I just want to make a few little, little tiny adjustments, but the car is just on rails right now and I'm just ready to go get a W. 